Twin flames. So let's talk about something, shall we? I've been seeing a lot of, I will not have my union in this lifetime, or it's just not for me because of external circumstances, or the psychic told me that it's not going to happen for me, at least not in this lifetime, or the the list goes on. And you're, if you're watching this video, you probably had those thoughts go through your mind, or you might even be sitting here feeling like, well, yeah, what she's saying, it's my truth too. Like, it's just not going to happen for me in this lifetime, and it may never happen for me. But I want to provide some insights and healing here on what it means to be in union with your twin flame and how you can have that if you choose it. And so we are divine beings and we create in our reality based on our choices, our thoughts, and our beliefs. And so you can look to your outer reality as it is right now and, and know that that is an extension of your consciousness. Literally everything that you're experiencing, it's an illusion, but it is a uh, kind of like a video game. You know, that would be probably the best way to describe it. Like you can put those, I don't know what those things are called, but you put them on and um, you can like, it's like really, it's like real, right? And you got the hand things and you really feel like you're in it, like you're interacting in it. And so that's like your reality is that you're creating by the previous choices, thoughts and beliefs that you hold in your vibration. And so leading into Twin Flame Union, if you're having this victim mentality and know that you were not created with victim mentality, you were not created powerless. And when I say power, I don't mean control. I mean, power is in peace, right? And, and surrender and uh, it's a peaceful feeling. It doesn't feel like a pushing or forcing or anything like that. It just feels like a, a relaxing into, okay? And so you were created with free will and with power, you are divine. And so because you're so powerful and because you're divine, you get to create in your reality what you want. And you can have a desire in your heart and you can choose and claim that desire. And you can move, your, move, move in the direction of that or you can experience that desire and tell yourself, no, I'm not worthy of that. I can't actually have that. That's not going to happen for me. And that is what you will experience, okay, based off of your thoughts and your beliefs. But if you're watching this video and you have the desire in your heart for your twin flame union, know that it is for you to have in this lifetime. You're not being, you know, um, strung along by some carrot or you know you're not being punished by the universe or something like that that's that's silly you have a desire because god gave you that desire and that desire is for you to claim but you can't be forced into that you have to willingly claim it for yourself and when you willingly claim that desire for union for yourself all of those thoughts all of those belief systems all of those previous choices start to come up to the surface to be healed. And so let's say you choose and claim your twin flame union, and then all of a sudden you start having all of these feelings of that you're just not worthy of it. Well, that was the next step. That has to um, be cleansed from your vibration in order for the truth to take its place in your, in your mind, in your heart, in your consciousness. And so it's choosing to let go of victim mentality choosing to let go of powerlessness and really claiming and taking full responsibility for what it is that you're creating in your reality and what you want to create, right? Your dreams and desires, they are yours to have. Um, and if you're interested and you're serious about doing that, then do it right now. Choose and claim what's in your heart, choose and claim your union and whatever step God gives you to take next, take that step because that's um, the unfolding of the physical manifestation of your union. And so, yeah, you create in your reality and you can have anything and everything that you want. And I feel like that covers it pretty well. Just know that you, yeah, 
you live based off of what you're thinking. And this is basic law of attraction, guys. Like you can watch Abraham Hicks. You can watch Eckhart Tolle. There's so many, so many uh, other spiritual teachers, right? That have taught this stuff and they, they share insights and wisdom and divine truth that we are divine beings and we create whatever whatever is within our vibration. So yes, if you have the desire in your heart, choose and claim it and move towards it. And I am Master Certified Ascension Coach with Twin Flames Universe. If you're seeking Twin Flames support, feel free to reach out. I'd be happy to help you. Otherwise, we'll see you in the next video.